Hey y'all, good morning. Welcome to Season with Love. I'm Casey. Welcome to my kitchen. Today is Sunday morning, y'all. And I'm making potatoes for Sunday dinner, y'all. Now I'm about to come up with something myself. I was gonna make some potatoes are grind, my classic recipe, but I decided to make something different. So I came up with this recipe I'm gonna make. Uh, I'm gonna use all these herbs. I got this little cute spice rack from Walmart came with all the herbs in it and everything so I'm gonna make a herb blend with chives basil parsley oregano herb de Provence and rosemary I'm gonna blend those all up I'm also gonna add some thyme as well this spice rack did not come with the thyme I have some uh, organic thyme leaves right here I'm gonna make a spice blend from there I'm gonna make a spice blend here to add on these potatoes I got some minced garlic some regular salt and pepper y'all I got this recipe for y'all today I'm making onion and garlic herb roasted cheesy potatoes y'all stay tuned on season with love so here I got about two four six eight nine small potatoes using so many because this usually this bag have large potatoes I don't know for some reason today they were very small so I'm using nine potatoes I'm trying to feed about six people all right y'all we want to cut our potatoes for this dish that we making I'm just gonna cut them like this it's a nice little dice like this that's it and half and half again Bust it two times. That's it. Do one more for y'all. In half. Half again. This one a little long. Well, still about the same. That's it. Get them all about the same size. Y'all see the size we want? And get them cut up. Blanch them and get back with y'all. Y'all, we got our potatoes blanching right here. We only want to cook our potatoes for about 10 to 12 minutes. We don't want them fully cooked because remember, we're going to finish these in the oven. This is roasted onion and garlic herb cheesy potatoes. Okay? I'm going to season with love today. I'm about to get started on my cheese sauce. I'm going to show y'all how I'm going to do that. You know, I already have the rest of my ingredients over here. I got some onions I finally diced. I got all my herb blend right here. I got some onion powder and garlic powder we're gonna season these potatoes with. I got some minced garlic and regular salt and pepper. Y'all, we making onion and garlic herb cheesy roasted potatoes on Season With Love Sunday dinner, y'all. Stay tuned. All right, y'all, so for my cheese sauce, I'm gonna go ahead and get four tablespoons of full of uh, butter, melt it down in this pan to this butter. I'm gonna add uh, my diced onion and my minced garlic, okay? All right, y'all, I got my onions in here. My butter done sweated down. Now I'm gonna add, uh, remember we making roasted herb, onion and garlic herb potatoes. Okay, so this is our cheese sauce for our roasted onion and garlic herb potatoes, cheesy potatoes. So I'm gonna add about a yeah, teaspoon full of minced garlic. I think I'm gonna add a teaspoon and a half, guys. All the potatoes. Now I'm gonna get these in here cooked for a second, and then so I'm gonna just sweat this down for just about a minute and a half. You know, because it's gonna finish cooking in the oven. Our vegetables are gonna be tender, I'm pretty sure. So what we're gonna do is uh. Add two tablespoons of flour to this because we added um, a couple of tablespoons of butter. So we're gonna add flour. We're gonna make a roux, y'all, for this cheese sauce. Right, y'all, we're gonna add about two tablespoons full of flour in here. Okay, about two tablespoons. We're gonna get this whisk in just to cook out that raw flour taste. You know, we're gonna just whisk this right on in. Let this cook for about a minute or two. 
because we want to cook that flour taste out of here. You know, flour is, is not cooked, it's raw. You know, if you guys didn't know that, this is why people make rules and cook it. And you know, it helps brown gravies and the brown and you get it. But we're making what they call a blonde roux today. So we're gonna get this flour cooked down and then we're gonna whisk in a nice cold cup of half and half. So I'm gonna whisk in about two cups of half and half. Start out with one, okay? And I'm gonna add that in here and keep whisking, okay? Now I'm gonna whisk these lumps out and get that combined. I'm gonna get two cups of half and half in here. And we're gonna bring this up to a nice little simmer until it, we're gonna keep whisking. And this is gonna start to thicken for us. Once it start thicken, we're gonna add 16 ounces of Velveeta cheese. I got some, because that's the cheese I wanna use as a, a processed American, you know, like Velveeta. You can use, you can start adding, you know, the cheese of your choice. You know, Colby would go good with this. Uh, uh, if you wanna do a, a pepper jack, that sounds like it would go good with this. If you wanna add a little kick, you know, add a little jalapeno to this, you know, kick it up a notch if you want. You know, make it your own. I'm just doing what I'm doing. This is how I want to do it. So I'm going to keep whisking this until it's sticking up. And y'all come back when I get ready to add this cheese. All right, y'all see our sauce that's sticking up for us, yeah? Now we're going to season it. Now I'm going to add a pinch of nutmeg. Not too much, just because it brings out that cheesy flavor. I'm gonna add some black pepper. Whole lot of black pepper. I love black pepper in my cheese sauce. And some regular pink Himalayan sea salt. Not too much. But that cheese is pretty salty. We're gonna continue to whisk this. See that sticking it up for us nicely. Get that on the low heat. Now, what we're gonna do is drop, turn off this heat. And we're gonna start to add our cheese. I got 16 ounces of Velveeta cheese right here that I've cubed up. I'm gonna add this in there. Remember, we have our onion in there, our garlic, you know. So now I'm gonna whisk this, continue to melt our cheese in here. Okay, once our cheese melt down, I'll show y'all what this sauce is looking like. If it gets too thick, you can always add a little bit of milk, you know, which it looks like I'm gonna be doing. <laughs> Cause this look really thick, you know, before we add it. Because we're going to finish baking this in the oven. Now, we got that heat off. Remember, there's no heat under this pot, okay? I'm going to go ahead and get this cheese melted in here, y'all. All right, y'all. So now our potatoes is hot and ready. I'm going to hit it with just uh, a little bit of butter, okay, while they still hot. Just a little bit. All right, and I'm gonna add these herbs on there. Remember our herb blend that I showed y'all that we was making? This is our blend of herbs right here. This is Herb de Provence, parsley, basil, oregano, thyme, and rosemary. So we gonna get all these herbs mixed up in here because remember y'all, we making onion and garlic, cheesy herb roasted potatoes, y'all. <laughs> Something I, I didn't came up with, but try the recipe. Okay, I know you enjoy it. No, don't knock it till you try it, y'all. So we got our potatoes that we parboiled in the lightly salted water. So we're not going to add any seasoning to here. We're going to mix our cheese sauce, get our cheese sauce mixed up with these potatoes, get it in the oven. I'm going to show y'all what it's looking like right before I put this in the oven. Mix. You might have more cheese sauce than you need. That's all right. You know, better to have more than less. And if you ain't got enough, then you know, it's not good. Ooh, y'all, this look how good this is looking, y'all. It look like we gonna might use all this. Okay, just about all of it. Ooh, y'all, that's looking good. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. Ooh, wait, look at that. Okay, y'all. This is my herb, onion and garlic, cheesy, roasted potatoes, y'all. Ooh, wait, y'all look at that. Get a close up on that, babe. Pull that in, babe. Now look at the herbs on them potatoes, y'all. Now look at that. Oh my goodness, that is delicious. That is delicious, y'all. Go ahead, back it on back up, babe. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna top this. I got some sharp cheddar cheese here. I'm gonna go ahead and, and put a little bit on the top of here. Not too much. As y'all know, we got that cheese sauce. That cheese sauce is real cheesy. We then sauteed our onions in it and our garlic. So we're just gonna top this off with just a little sprinkle of cheese. Okay? And we're gonna get this in the oven, uncovered, y'all. And let this get nice roasted because these are these are roasted potatoes you know we already parboiled them you know so they they're most of the way cooked so we don't want to steam these and you know so we just going to get them in the oven and roast them y'all brown it off i'm gonna let y'all see what it's looking like let y'all know exactly how long i baked it at the end of the video y'all stay tuned we making onion and garlic herb cheesy roasted potatoes on season with love y'all he roasted out of the oven. We put them under the broiler to get this nice little char on our cheese sauce on the top. Put them under there for about five minutes under the broiler on high. Let it get our nice little topping on there, y'all. We made onion and garlic, herb, cheesy, roasted potatoes, y'all, on Season With Love. <laughs> I'm going to get that name right, I promise you. I made it up. I should be able to get it right. <laughs> Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And hit that notification bell. So you'll be notified every time I upload one of these delicious recipes, y'all. If you're new to this page, thank you for watching. If you already subscribed, I really appreciate all your support. You know, please continue watching. All right, y'all. We got our potatoes out of the oven. We're gonna let them rest for about 10 minutes. All right, y'all. Our potatoes have rested. We have let it sit for about 15 minutes. So everything is set up nicely, beautifully. Let me serve up a plate, give these a taste. See what, what they what they what they tasting, what they hitting for, y'all. Cut into it, get a nice spoonful. Woo wee, y'all, look at that. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, y'all. Look at that. Oh, the potatoes are nice and firm. Oh my goodness, y'all, look at that. Oh, my goodness. That looks amazing. Y'all see, they not... Potatoes is still kept their shape. They not mushy. You know? Oh, my goodness, y'all. I'm gonna hit it off with a little bit of parsley on there. Y'all look at that. <laughs> that looks absolutely to die for, y'all. Oh, my goodness, y'all. This is a garlic, onion and garlic, herb, cheesy roasted potatoes, y'all. Let me give it a try. Ooh, they still piping hot. I'm gonna burn this crazy, my mouth crazy. Let me give this a taste, y'all. Oh, M, G. Oh my goodness. I gotta let my cameraman taste these, y'all. Oh my goodness, they're creamy, cheesy, delicious. That sauce, the garlic in that sauce. Oh my goodness, it is so good, y'all. Try this recipe, y'all gotta try this recipe. Oh my goodness, y'all. It is so delicious. Y'all gotta try it, y'all. Y'all have to. My goodness. Y'all, come back. For another video on season with love god bless y'all have a blessed day